What's up YouTube? Silverhammer Aetis there and welcome back to more Hogwarts Legacy. We're on part 21. Uh, we're continuing on with the story. Uh, A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here? I know, I've got the mask on. It's quite good. Uh, Clue presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Urtgot did not have the effect I'd Lord hoped. Gok. Here. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. How else did he expect Goblin Kind to get the helmet back? Seems he has no interest in making amends with you. I'm afraid no, I've got a mask on, and um, my character's not expectation when it comes speaking. To well, he's speaking. I thought that I thought that would. I thought that, would. I thought that uh, costume would go well. I like it. I kind of like it with the mask. suppose I must tell you more. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbore's journals. They described repositories that Bragbore had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, yeah. magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle. That is where we began our search. Why does Ranrock care so much about these repositories? He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards mm. have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Mm, interesting. Was convinced that the repositories <laughs> contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to take it for goblin kind. But he's... here comes my friend Armit. Probably best to continue our conversation later. Greetings, Lord Gok. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. Enough. Please do not tell me that was meant to be gobbledygook. I am. Um, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it. I can. <laughs> Just I think he's taking a Michael. Thankfully, we only taking a need joke. someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. What written plans? And why can't you come with us? Yeah, why can't you? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ranrock. All you need to do is not be seen, either by the eye above the enchanted door or a loitering loyalist. Hmm, interesting. What else should we know about the enchanted door? The door will not open while the eye can see you. You and your friend must be invisible to it to gain access. Hmm. From what I know of wizard magic, that shouldn't be too difficult to achieve. I'll meet and I can do this. I will await your return. Hmm, interesting. I shall see you soon. Right, so. So we need to access. This problem. Right, so it can't. So we need to be invisible. looking at us nice right I guess we're going into the mind books so rarely prepare one for reality a real god of mine rebellion it's even grander than I had expected you gotta be careful now around there I cannot believe I met a bombarder let's just learn what we can and get out Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple a device. Impressive workmanship aside, it's the only way forward. Wait. The 
These machines are Confringos. No, Confringos, there we go. Alright, let's go on through. I'm enjoying this game by the way, it really is amazing. Right, let's see what we've got here. That should open it. I've read about mines like this. Wait a second, wait a second. That leads somewhere, but I don't know where that leads. Oh, wait. Stay close to me. I don't want to lose the place. Oh, great. Shut out. We're going to be careful now. Don't want to get spotted. Nice. I'll get us through safe moment. You have my word. We need to sort out this. Nice. There we go. Wait, confirm go. Revelio. I feel like a character from one of the adventure books I read during the summer holidays. I should be able to get that up there now. Hmm, interesting. I don't know how to get that. Nice. Nice. Get this now. Mystery item, nice. Let's take a look around, I'll meet. See if we can find any plans. Schematic. I will get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. Rebellion. What are they planning down here? I wonder what they're planning down here. Get more cash. So what they've been collecting. Nice. The flourishes are extraordinary. There must be more lots around here. What could they be building? I wonder what they're building. Maybe another passageway of some sort. If I'm translating this correctly, and I think that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to the other side. Oh, whoopsies. Oh, 
Nice. Rebellion. Stay close. I've handled much worse. Another boiler. This place is more complex than I had expected. Good for you. Probably change that. This is the right way. So I don't know if this is the right way. Nasty stuff if we're not careful. Luma. Luma. Not an entanglement we need right now. There we go, take some more stuff. Rebellion. Luma. Luma. Something down this way. Rebellion. We hold on, hold on. Before I go down that way, I wanna, I wanna see what's down here. Don't wanna miss anything out. It's important. Never chest here. Nice. Uh, what else is there? We could use that. Nice. Right, that's going through. That's a blocked way. Right, I guess we're going the other way. Can't take him on, but more of those. Christ. Ow. Anymore now. Something down here. Give me more cash, that, uh, that's good at least. Wait, no. Bombarder. The Ringo. There we go. Oh. Nice. Let's try it now. 
There's a lift that goes up to there. Let's collect this. This is not good. They're building enormous drills, bigger than this mine could contain. Let's get out of here and tell Lodgo what we found. Wait, oh, he just appears. I need a moment to catch my breath. This was more than I bargained for. I'm glad you came with me, Omit. Now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. That's well, a good thing you came with us. What are they up to? I wonder. Like, are like, are they, are they building a big mine or some sort? Revelio. We're almost out of here, Armit. Look, the lift. A welcome sight indeed. Do a low Hamora. A low Hamora. See what there is. There we go. Uh, right, let's see what else is around here. Uh, right, let's continue upwards. I don't know how much money I've got, but I feel like I've got quite a few bits and bobs. Right, let's exit through this. Ow, oh, this mine. Oh, God. Can we please talk? That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. For a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. I couldn't have done it without you. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lodgok. Understood? I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secrets are safe with me, but I get to write the book about this escapade someday. <laughs> Fair enough. Without further ado, at you. <laughs> at you. <laughs> I get the joke. I get the joke. They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Drills. Apparently I wonder why they're building drills. The repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however. I do not know where else he plans to search. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So I was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. When she looked up, Interesting. I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. Without a moment's hesitation, she smiled and asked me to sit with her. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small oddly shaped container with the strange symbol on it. She was certain it was made of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Miriam. Yes. But how did you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research, and I know of the container. Of course. Ah. Of course, it's her, Miriam. She talked of goblins and their intelligence and skill. It caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways, with her promising to share what she'd learned. More of Ranrock's recruits arrived, and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Ranrock was thrilled with our discovery. 
but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch. He told Ranrock about Miriam. I can't say her name. Miriam. Miriam. I can't say her name. I don't want to believe it. But I don't know. Hmm. Interesting. That, something shifted in me. I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock, transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lord Gok, for telling me this. Mm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor at some point built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. Mm. I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl. Interesting, very interesting. I wonder if Rangrock killed her. I don't know. It's interesting to hear this though, it really is. Very interesting though. God, I might have to do so many of these. It's very interesting not to hear that. Nice, we got a talent, we got a skill. Uh, what do I want to use it on? Dark arts. Let's use the dark arts. I might want to get this Merlin try out of the way and done dusted. That's the entrance to you have a map. Oh here's a pleasant surprise. There we go. Any more? Aha, uh -huh, there's more. Nice, that's a Merlin trial down. I like these Merlin trials. They're quite easy. Well, some of them are easy, some of them not. Right, let's head to... These fast travels are really useful. They really are. They really do help me travel get... They do really uh, help me out. Travel. Could go to the shop, actually. Thank you for all that you've done for us. No blobs. Uh, sell some of these. No pops, indeed. I always say no pops. That's such a British, British saying. Well, that's probably because I am British. To be, to be fair, I am British. Though, to be fair, I'm say a little British. Worse. Oh. If there is any chance that the relic from Slytherin's spellbook can help her, I must find it. I'm requesting your help. Meet me outside of Feldcroft near the catacomb. Imperio. Ooh, Imperio. We could do Imperio actually. Imperio. 
Is that one of the that's one of the tasks? I have some promising news about the location of our Hebridean dragon friend. We need to learn Imperio actually speaking to which. Imperio is the other dark spell, I think. Yeah. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. Right, let's go and You're here. Good. Talk to Sebastian. Sebastian. That relic you mentioned. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment. Imperio is going to be interesting to use. In From what I read in a report by the student, they weren't permitted to take it with them. So I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. For Anne. I need to see her. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it. But I suspect if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. Agreed, yeah, definitely agreed. to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we finished. Perfect. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't. I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Hmm. Didn't really tell him, though, to be fair. Well, that's what it says. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Hmm, interesting. So, so we're going to learn... Uh, so we're going to learn Imperio. Hmm, Imperio, yes. That'll be interesting to learn. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just I'll Try not to. Oh. More of these bloody things. At least now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. And the rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, spiders aren't insects. Don't start. <laughs> Bombarder! Speaking of which, I need to jump up there. Whoopsies. Ah, crap. What the hell? Come on. Just need to get this thing. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. Ooh, spiders. Yeah. God, I hate these bloody spiders. So let's uh, take some of this stuff. Now this is Revelio. I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Seems odd. Damn, I hate these bloody spiders. Right, let's go and uh, do this story. Continue on with this quest. Right, so what do we have to do here? There's something here by the altar. Oh my lanta. We're in the tomb. I assume eerie sounds come with the territory. 
I need to make a staircase of some sort. Wait a second. So, it, so how do you open this then? What did you find? Rebellion. Confront them. We've made it this far, but clearly we have more to do. Oh my god. I got a sneak way of doing it. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing there, but... I need to find a safe way across. Hmm... What are we going to be doing? Lumos. Accio. Lumos. Accio. Lumos. Accio. Lumos. Accio. Midalia Leviosa. Nice. There we go. I'll do that. Accio. Midalia Leviosa. How would I do this? How would I do this? Oh, there we go. Rickety bone bridge complete. There we go. Nice. Revelio. Need to get more, more of those. Accio. Midalia Leviosa. Accio. Revelio. Accio. Midalia Leviosa. Accio. Nice. Let's go. Nice. I'm good at these puzzles. Can't jump up there. I guess we're going on forward then. Oh. Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the Great Room, which means this can't be a dead end. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the... 
Hold on to that diary entry. There may be... It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius Curse. Really? Interesting. Imperius we Curse. focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. Of course. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. There we go. Revelio. Before we trudge on further, I just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperius Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. How do you know the Imperius Curse? What does, what does the, uh, what does it, uh, does learning the curse entail? I would probably like to learn the Imperius Pierce curse. Yeah, I'll do it's it. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save Might as well use it because it's difficult. quite dangerous. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Hmm. Let's learn it. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. Why are we going backwards? Nice, Imperio. Something troubling ahead. I have a feeling there is going to be something troubling. Revelio, Nice. That's sort of a glitch. Yeah, that's a bit of a glitch. Another barricade. Considering how well you did on the last one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious of you. I try. Nice. Revelion. This looks different than what we faced before. Now we're all Damn. I think it was useful for us to use Imperio. Nice. God, I hate spiders. I honestly hate spiders. Nice. Some time. It's quite scary, you know, these uh, some of these uh, yeah. missions. Spiders are bloody creepy, you know. Come on. Hold on, it's a puzzle. Revelio. Accio. 
Nice. Rebellion. Okay, that. Nice. I should open that this way now. Head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. Nice. Rebellion. I see why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. Oh great, more of these bloody things. Oh great, more of these bloody spiders. Nice. I hate these bloody big spiders. Whoa! For a moment there I thought that'd never end. Nice. That was quite intense fight that. Rebellion. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Ooh. Wait. Hold on. Is this the three Deathly Hollows? The three Deathly Hollows, isn't it? Sebastian. The relic. Look. Oh, the relic. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. So the three. This must be where Deathly the Hollows left the relic. No, it's not. It. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. I'm willing to ignore what the journal entry says. We're taking the relic. Agreed. This is meant to be. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I don't know if that was the right I decision. This relic secret, especially from my uncle. Ah, uh, ominous. Are we gonna have to fight? Ominous. Oh no, ominous. Ominous. The sounds we kept hearing. It was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Oh, God, are we going to fight on, Ominous? Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. Oh, God. How much did you hear? Everything. I heard you encourage Sebastian to take the relic. Sebastian's done his research. He knows what he's doing. Sebastian makes things sound easy when they could be impossible or dangerous. We need to stop him. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. Oh, God. Oh, see. Oh, God, do I want to side with him? Or do I want to talk with Sebastian? Oh, God! Ah, oh, damn, damn. God, uh, what choice do I put? What choice do I make? What if Anonymous is right? And what if he's right? That's the thing.
sorry, Ominous. I'm really sorry. Sebastian's right. We need that relic. I'm sorry. My mind is made up. Are you willing to sacrifice your friendship over this? I might be. How could I choose to stand by and watch him do this? What if the choice wasn't yours? You wouldn't be to blame for what happens. What in the world are you suggesting? Imperium? Imperio? That's what I'm saying. I would take all responsibility. This could save your friendship. I know how to cast it. Sebastian taught me. But I won't do it unless you agree. This is insanity. I can't believe you would ask this of me. Sebastian is never going to give up trying to cure Anne. If you try and stop him now, he'll never forgive you. I'm... I... fine. This is unfathomable. But I suppose if you want that responsibility, it may just save what is left of... of my friendship with Sebastian. Remember, this is what I was telling you about the Dark Arts. They come with a cost. You may well regret making this choice. Do what you have to do. Cast it. Before I change my mind. Imperio. Oh Christ, what have we done? Step aside, Ominous. Stay in place until we're out of sight. I will. Sebastian, come on. What did you do? Imperio, it was the only way to get out of here without a fight. Ominous, I'm sorry. Sebastian, we have to go. Oh, Christ, was that the right decision? You oh. The thing. You need the relic. I know. But not like this. Ominous and I agreed. Surely there's a difference between casting it we... on someone without their knowledge and casting it with... I don't know if that was the right thing. Was that the right idea? I think, I think that was... <sighs> I've taken full responsibility. So Imperio is like to do with mind control. Damn, I don't know if that was the right decision. Oh God. God, oh God. I don't know if that was the right decision. So Imperio is to do with mind control. So we, I think we did the right thing without cause. It, I think I, if, if we didn't learn Imperio, then we would cause a fight. And kill Ominous. So I think I did the right thing not killing Ominous. On Ominous? Yeah, Ominous. Something like that. <laughs> oh my god, that was so hard. That was a difficult choice. I had no choice. We've always looked out for each other, Ominous and I. I hope he knows that hasn't changed. We'd agree to it as well. <sighs> Bugger. How long would the spell last? How long must Ominous stay in the tomb? The curse is lifted already. He'll easily find his way out of the catacomb just as we did. He'll be all right, Sebastian. My God, honestly. Uh, so I think we did the right thing. I don't know if we did. I don't know if I did because there's like different choices that you can make. I think there's maybe opportunities where if you're dealing with Omnus there... Onimus there. Yeah, Onimus there. Then there's a chance that he'll fight. When we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like Ominous. Ominous, yeah. Really Ominous. Thing is, there would have been a, a chance... There would have been, like, maybe endings or so, like, oh, of... No. This isn't good. Oh, no. What is it? Smoke. Over there, by the hamlet. Oh, Jesus. What happened there? They're under attack. Let's hurry. Not quite. Jesus. Damn. Wow, bloody hell. 
see that we would have killed. I, I think there might have been. There might have been. That might have been moments. There might have been moments, maybe where Omnis might have been killed, or maybe Sebastian might be killed of some sort. I think we only got one spell left, which is the Avakadabra spell. Avakadabra. Nice. Oh no, Anne! That goblin's gonna kill her! Jesus Christ! That's a bit dark. Boy, what have you done? Saved my sister. Still an unforgivable curse from that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. Jesus. What did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. It was, uh... You did what you had to do. I think it was if the right I idea. proving that to my uncle, I will. It was the right choice. Do not banish me from my own home. From my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. Imperio. So that's what Imperio does. Jeez. Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. This family does not resort to using dark magic even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Why, Sebastian? Um. Oh, God. See, you know, when we learn dark arts and, like, the dark magic... Such as like Imperio and Imperio and uh, Crucio and uh, Avagradabra. Avag I can't even say it right. Avagradabra. Jeez. Uh, Holy Christ! At least we did. At least Anonymous didn't die. At least Anonymous didn't die because uh, we wanted him to be alive. Right. I best get on with. Uh, Speak with Spazastian in the undercover. Hmm. Jeez, I don't know if that was the right idea. I mean, I wanted to learn Imperio. Imperio. Right, let's go and speak with Sp Sebastian. <laughs> Poor Sebastian, though. No.
Oh, Did Sebastian. You speak to my uncle? I wish I had better news about your uncle and Anne. Well, what did he say? I'm afraid he wants you nowhere near Feldcroft. Nor Anne. I had to stop that goblin from killing my sister. He had no right to banish me from my own twin. <sighs> if he thinks banishing me means I'm going to give up on Anne, he's sorely mistaken. He also said he cannot excuse the use of dark magic in any form. And that if he hears of either of us using it, he'll go straight to Professor Black. Huh. That relic, dark magic or not, is the key to saving Anne. To reverse that curse. I will not lose Anne for good. I should send the crest to Anne. She'll know that we need to meet. I'm afraid I don't follow. Nothing, just a thought. Now I'm more determined than ever to learn what power that relic has. What did you mean you'd send Anne a crest so that she'd know to meet you? It's yeah. We just lost our parents, and we were packing up to go and live with Solomon. We couldn't take everything. She was carefully organizing her prized possessions, a box of artifacts she'd collected to do with our family. Jewelry, cards, old photographs. She got to her favorite, a handmade crest, and without a second thought, she handed it to me. This will keep you safe, she said. It holds no enchantment, but I've kept it with me since. That's how I can reach Anne. I'll get the crest to her with plans to meet. Be careful, Sebastian. Your uncle could intercept it. We'll be expelled. Even if Ominous is upset with us, he has no love lost for his family. He'd use their connections to the headmaster if we needed his help. Hmm. I shall wait to hear from you then. Thank you. I'll send you an owl when I have news. Interesting. Very interesting. Damn. Oh, jeez, these dark spells are really full, honestly. They're useful, though. They're very useful, but dangerous as well. Don't want to get found out that I'm using dark spells. <laughs> Crucia and that. Damn. And this is where they put me. Oh, that's a Death Eater. <laughs> oh, these can talk. These can talk. I didn't even know. Uh, I didn't even know to say you can talk. There's statues. Right. I'm probably going to end it here. So if you uh, guys want to like the video and uh, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.